doing a scramble from VC Bird. We've got a couple of ships to photograph off to the northeast. Let's get this show on the road. Rotating. Tap the brakes, gear up. Looking good. Gear is up, climbing out, turning to the northwest. Hope the radio still works. Yep. Right, let's see if I can pick these up on my uh, my radar. The yeah, ground radar I've got here. Frequency change. Frequency change. Copy. VC Bird Tower Makeman 007 frequency change. It's the Aussie accent confuses um, most computers actually. Right, let's go to the recon cam under the fuselage. See if we can spot these ships. about 11 o'clock and there's also uh, some air traffic I think ships there at 10 o'clock but I'm now worried about that aircraft It's coming in for about one o'clock. All right, well, let's ID this ship because we're pretty close. Let's go to the, the uh, nose cam. Looks like two cargo ships container ships I'd say. Still got an aircraft at one o'clock somewhere. Camera. Camera. Oh, do it manually. There's one shot. There's two. That'll be me. That'll be me. Four miles, 200 feet. Um, that means this guy's up here somewhere. Damn. I can always see me before I can see them. That's kind of um, Just one mile away. Unbelievable. Well, so much for my career as a fighter pilot, but <laughs> I cannot defeat the humble Cessna. Wow, you can see me, he's letting off sidewinders left, right and centre, and I've got diddly focus, diddly squat, where is he? I haven't got, I've got him on my um, rudimentary radar here, but uh, I've got no altitude, I oh, guess 1,800 feet, got it now. Right, so he's 900 feet above me. Must be up in the cloud. He's hiding in the cloud. You know, it's not really fair, is it? I got nothing. I got nothing. How embarrassing is that? I've got my, um, yeah, got all my lights on. 
Well, it's not a problem, he can see me, but where is he? He's just trying to duck above. Let's see if we can look down. It's supposed to be near that ship. Back there. This guy's an expert at hiding. He must be a smuggler. So there's one ship, there's another ship. Right, he's supposed to be near there. Just passing that ship, but boy, I cannot see. Right, let's go down past the ship. Maybe we'll get lucky. That's hilarious. Soviet super fighter uh, pilot being crushed here by Cessna. That's just not, um, just not right. Cessna have the yeah, right. Well, I haven't got you in sight, mate. You know, I get a picture of the ship. Hi. Right. You look great, but I'm not in a good mood now. Where is it? Where is that guy? Supposed to be about 10 o'clock. Uh, getting altitude ready out. Yeah, about a thousand feet, right? I'm, I'm about 500. Well, phew. so much for protecting the. Uh, Oh, there he is, there he is. Boy, that was hard to see. <laughs> oh, that is... Hilarious. That's right, that's right. Yeah, you better. I, I can see you now, buddy. Wow. How hard was that? Those little things are hard to see because they're so small. That's my excuse. That uh, is a classic. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> I've got no hope. Righto. I'll go back to that ship. It's a bigger target and moving much more slowly. Get a picture of that and then. Um, sheepishly return to base. Be a laughing stock after that. Right. Yeah, that's right, you better watch out ship. Uh, I'm heading your way. Yeah. That's right. That's right. You know who's boss. Right. Camera Even the computer's ignoring me now. Camera. Yep, no good at all. Righto, that's RTB. That was pretty sad, but fun. Channel 2. Channel 1. Double O seven three. Double O seven three. VC Bird Tower Migman 007 is nine or miles west, four thousand feet, with Papa to land. Migman 007 VC Bird Tower. Altimeter two nine or decimal nine or two wind zero seven three at one three. Make straight in runway zero seven. 
Clear to land. Clear to land. Make straight in runway 07 Migman 007. Right, I've got 07 dialed in. Well, I've pretty much besmirched the name of uh, 007 around here forever. Now I think I can, yeah, I can see him. Migman 007, wind 073 at 13. Clear to land, runway 07. Clear to land. Roger. Clear to land, runway 07, Migman 007. I think I can see uh, at about 10 o'clock. DC Bird Tower Cessna, November 76227, is one mile east, 300 feet, with Papa to land. But maybe it's maybe it's just the. Cessna, November 76227, DC Bird Tower. Altimeter 29 decimal minor, 2 wind 073 at 13. Probably just the beacon at the airport. Fly left, downwind, runway 07. Anyway, um. Here's the runway, but who's number one, who's number two? Well, I'm clear to land, so I guess I'll drop the gear. Fly left traffic, runway 07 Cessna 227. I'm going to try an extended brake, ex extra thrust. So that gear's down, speed brake is extended. Throttling, throttling up accordingly. Yeah, that light was um, at the airport, 10, 11 o'clock. I can't even line up properly now. What a shocker. Going around. Going around. Yeah, I'm all discombobulated by that... Uh, Failed intercept. Try again. Ninety degrees coming to downwind. What a failure. Here's my radio towers, we're a bit low. And a bit slow. Okay, pretty much on track, speed up another 30 knots and return to final. Right, 350, throttles back, pulling 3G. Gear down. There's a, there's a threshold. Let's see if we can make this semi professional. By the way, I still had the speed brake up. That is, it's going to be risky um, behaviour. Uh, employing speed brake on landing. Good example there, I forgot to retract it. I think I'll stick to my. Uh, no speed brake landings at the moment. This thing's got so much power. It can dig me out of any hole anyway. Right, let's try again. Got three greens. Getting too low now, but run my in sight. I'll let it sink a bit and flare at the last minute and yeah, pretty smooth actually yep uh, now speed brake out toe brakes on Whew. speed brake in alright so where's my exit I'm going to take the utility exit here. Migman 007 contact ground on 121 decimal minor. Copy. 
going to 121.9er Migman 007. Right, well, that's one uh, sorty. Uh, oh, look, it was, it was actually not a fun. Failing could be fun. That's my motto.